I want to commit to chastity, now what? Choosing to say yes to chastity is indeed half the battle. However, how can we patiently choose to live out this radical virtue if we don't know how? When it came to faithfully living out chastity in college for myself, the struggle was so real. I remember saying that yes, and then swiftly getting a good old kick in the rear by the over-sexualized culture that we live in. Chastity is a lifestyle that can seem overwhelming, lonely, and even intimidating. If we're going to achieve chastity, we have to exercise and build patterns in our lives that replace the patterns of the past. We must forego certain things that we find desirable and fix our eyes on the goal for the higher good. We need spiritual disciplines, attending daily mass, the sacrament of confession, holy hour, reading scripture, and prayer. Aside from our spiritual disciplines, I want to provide a few practicals that can aid in your pursuit for this life-giving virtue. Number one, be gentle with yourself. As humans, failing is part of our nature. When we make a mistake, it can be easy to go on a downward spiral of beating ourselves up. Take a deep breath. It's okay. Chastity is a lifestyle, not just a temporary fix. Yes, there will be times where the spirit is willing, but the flesh is weak. One of my all-time favorite quotes comes from St. Faustina. Your sin is a pebble in the ocean of God's mercy. There is no sin too great for the mercy of Christ. Number two, find community. We can't do this alone. We have to surround ourselves with those who not only keep us accountable, but who are also willing to walk beside us. As humans, we were made for community. We were made to be together, and we were made for greatness, together. Number three, read, read, read. You can never educate yourself enough. This was such a game changer for me. By taking the time to educate myself, I not only strengthened my understanding theologically, but also practically. If you're looking for books to read, read about the lives of the saints. Check out Theology of the Body. Pick up the Bible, read scripture. There's so many accounts of the lives of people who were ordinary, who wanted to strive for the extraordinary virtue of chastity. Number four, know you are not alone. Know there are people all around the world who believe in you and also believe in the goodness of the human person. There are young people all around the globe striving to be revolutionaries. Social media can be a platform used to connect us all across the globe and even in our local communities. Find local events in your area, join a Bible study, or even start your own. Be a revolutionary, be radical, swim against the tide, and know that you are capable of true love. As one of my dear friends, St. Pope John Paul II once said, chastity is a difficult long-term matter. One must wait patiently for it to bear fruit. But at the same time, chastity is the sure way to happiness.